Titans topped Mexico. M go for your guy is giving you the Bujin top eight Mexicano deck profile. Uh, I don't know. Uh, looking at this deck as an overall whole here, um, he is maining the Kaiser Coliseum, which has pretty much been stated as being mandatory uh, for the current Bujin builds. And to top things off, it also looks like. Uh, his deck is just pretty standard. Um, he is packing only one of Bear instead of two, and he's also got the hand traps, which many players have opted to continue to play as well. And the only other side effect of uh, this particular deck is he is playing the, MD or, uh, the two Night Beams, uh, which is player preference. Uh, Mystical Space Typhoon seems like it'd be a better choice, uh, but that's up to you. So let's start things off. Triple Yamato, the Triple Turtles, one Bear, two Quillians, Triple Crane, one Anas. Two Maxis, two Veilers, as for spells, the two Night Beams, triple Duality, triple Lance, two Kaiser Coliseum, and two Tenki. As for the traps, triple Horn of the Phantom Beast, gotta get them pluses. Uh, two Dimensional Prisons, one Compulse, triple Emptiness, two Phoenix Chains, and the one of Solemn Warning. His extra deck, one Cowboy, one Dweller, one Emerald, one Maestro, one Cowboy, one Ice Beast, zero Fine. Uh, one Path Operative, the two Susano, Utopia and Utopia Ray, Pearl. Uh, as for the Synchros, Cataster, Armades, and Librarian. Gotta have access to those fives. His side deck, Kaiku. Those two MSTs to rotate. Two Malevolent Catastrophes. Two Trap Stunts. Two Overworked. Two Imperial Iron Walls. Two Gozen Matches. And then two Debunks for Color Cancellation Against Dragons. So guys, this is the Bujin Top 8 Mexico deck profile. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'm out.